Flying taxi ordered by American Airlines successfully completes first test flight. The VX4, the flying taxi American Airlines ordered, just completed its first piloted test flight. This was the first in a series of planned tests according to Vertical Aerospace, the British startup responsible for the aircraft. American Airlines has boldly ordered 250 of the aircraft, 50 are prepaid, 200 more are on the way, and they have an option for 100 more, most likely depending if and when the VX4s get certified by flight regulators. Vertical Aerospace is hoping they'll get certified as early as 2025. Although the test was not that visually impressive to the untrained eye as the 10-minute test had the tethered eight-propeller craft hovering three feet above the ground, it marks a large step in the production and development of electric vertical takeoff and landing, or EVTOL, aircraft technology. The goal was to determine if the craft could in fact lift itself up under its own weight. Vertical Aerospace's chief test pilot flew the aircraft, which hopes to one day carry up to four passengers. He was quoted as saying, This test represented the culmination of many months of preparation by a huge team. The entire test occurred inside an aircraft hangar. The piloted test required Vertical Aerospace to apply for a permit from the UK's aviation regulator, the Civil Aviation Authority, or CAA. Members of the CAA were present during the first test flight. The end game is an aircraft with a payload of 450 kilograms or 992 pounds, with a range of 100 miles or 161 kilometers, and a cruising speed of 150 miles or 241 kilometers per hour. Other companies in the race for EV toll supremacy are Joby Aviation's S4, Ehang's 216 and VT30, the luxurious Lilium Jets Phoenix 2, the Volocopter Volo City, Vertical Aerospace's VX4, and Archer Aviation's Maker. What do you think about EV tolls and their future in aviation? Share your thoughts by leaving a comment. Simple Flying publishes over 150 articles every week. If you're looking for the latest aviation news and insights, visit simpleflying.com.